Welcome back to the IBSP. Here's your host, Foxy New. Edgar Berlanga is the dummy of the day. And look, let's break it down honestly and objectively as possible. And Edgar Berlanga has come out and stated that he would love to go up to the heavyweight division and fight Anthony Joshua just to test greatness. He also went on to state that he would go ahead and fight Daniel Dubois as well. Now, this is one of the dumbest things Edgar Berlanga has said, and he said a lot of stupid things. He also states that he'll walk into the ring at heavyweight a whopping 210 pounds. Now, look, let me make it clear to you. Any fight against Daniel Dubois or Anthony Joshua, this guy's getting his ass whooped. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. And to be honest about it, he thinks that Anthony Joshua is somehow vulnerable to him because he got destroyed in this fight against Daniel Dubois. Newsflash, dummy, you're not Daniel Dubois. Anthony Joshua was face down, ass up. That's how Anthony Joshua will have you, you moron. You being 210 pounds means nothing to Anthony Joshua. He will knock you slap out. Let's be honest and unbiased. This is the same Edgar Berlanga who couldn't win one round against Canelo Alvarez, an undersized Canelo at 168. Canelo caught him, dropped him, hurt him, and the only reason Edgar Berlanga survived to see the end of the bell is because he was over 200 pounds pounds on the night of the fight. Edgar Berlanga confirmed this after the fight as well as with Eddie Hearn stating that he was 200 pounds. That's the only reason you survived a small guy who's 5'7 like Canelo Alvarez because you rehydrated up 200 pounds. But you fighting a heavyweight idiot, it's not going to matter because 200 pounds to Anthony Joshua means nothing. He would put you to sleep. He would take your head off. I mean, let's just be honest and unbiased. Edgar Berlanga, sit your dumb ass down, you filthy animal.